Developers say the traditional model for resort communities, centered on golf, hunting, or skiing, is no longer as appealing, as busy families want to maximize togetherness. Yellowstone Club in Montana is under new ownership after a bankruptcy filing in 2008 and has added kid-friendly activities like a climbing wall, movie theater, and a diner with kid-friendly options. The owners say the new options have helped the club grow its membership. So far this year, 45 have already joined, a jump from the only 10 new members who joined in all of 2009. Prices start at $1.5 million for lots, a requirement for membership. Pine Creek Sporting Club in Okeechobee, Florida, originally envisioned as a hunting club set around a cluster of 40-acre ranches, was reimagined as a 24-acre outdoorsy family resort that included hunting as well as kid-centric activities like arts and crafts, a zip line, and a petting zoo. Today, it's 60% sold with smaller furnished cabins starting at $700,000 and larger ranch properties priced as high as $5 million. Kukuyula on Kauai opened in 2011 and includes golf, guided hikes, and a large community farm. Martis Camp, near the north shore of Lake Tahoe, has a family barn that features a bowling alley, movie theater, and a folk school, with classes in photography and pottery. Experts say the shift comes as people are living longer and traveling with both parents, children, and grandchildren. It's also a response to sluggish sales at many golf clubs during the downturn. Consultants and industry observers say resort home communities are also taking a page from luxury hotel operators like the Ritz-Carlton, which has long offered kid camps and activities. For The Wall Street Journal, this is Candace Jackson.